Bible tells us in Genesis 15, 5, Look now toward heaven and tell the stars if thou be able to number them. Written 1491 B.C. Jeremiah 33, 22. As the host of heaven cannot be numbered. Written 590 B.C. Hebrews 11:12. So many as the stars of the sky in multitude, and as the sand which is by the seashore innumerable. Written A.D. 50. This tells us the stars cannot be numbered. Science told us long ago there are no more than 3,000 stars. Science now tells us the stars cannot be numbered. Discovered by Galileo, A.D. 1608. Called the Extreme Deep Field, or XDF, 10 years of photographs were taken by the Hubble Space Telescope. The photographs were then combined and overlapped. As shown here to scale in the bottom center, the XDF photographs were all taken within this very same small area of space, equaling a small fraction of the moon. This made it just a 30 millionth of the entire sky. The photographs captured deep images of the observable universe never before seen and revealed about 5,500 galaxies. A single galaxy can contain as few as 1,000 to as many as 100 trillion stars. Some astrophysicists now believe the number of stars in the universe to be over 300 sextillion. No human being would live long enough to count such a large number. From 1491 BC to AD 1608, there is a time span of 3,099 years. How did Moses, the author of Genesis, Jeremiah, the author of Jeremiah, and the unknown author of Hebrews know the stars cannot be numbered? If you like this video, please hit the like button below, share it with your friends, and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day.